Please rise for the 16th President of the United States, Abraham Lincoln. My fellow Americans and 2024 presidential candidates, I stand before you today with a heavy heart and a humble spirit to acknowledge and rectify a grave mistake that I made during my time as President of the United States. A mistake that cuts deep into the principles upon which this great nation was founded and has weighed heavily upon our nation's history. One embedded in the 13th Amendment, which has allowed slavery to continue. See, in 1865, I put my full support behind the 13th Amendment. Now, it was an amendment I believed would end the abhorred institution of slavery in this country. However, it included an exception. It was a concession, a compromise of sorts, made at a time when the nation was deeply divided and just beginning to heal from our civil war. Yet I did not anticipate the extent to which this exception would be used to perpetuate slavery behind prison walls, leading to continued suffering and injustice, particularly among black Americans. Slavery is not confined to the pages of history. Today, the painful and troubling reality of slavery persists in our prisons and jails where individuals endure hardship and suffering while being denied the opportunity for redemption and rehabilitation. And this matter is not merely about labor. It's about the degradation of humanity, the erosion of human dignity, and the exploitation of individuals for the social, economic, and political gain of others. It perpetuates inequality, denies fundamental human rights, and obstructs our path to genuine justice. I earnestly call upon Congress and the next President of the United States to pass the Abolition Amendment and in the exception in the 13th Amendment. Now, this is not a matter of political ideology or partisanship. It is a matter of compassion, conscience, and moral obligation. It is our shared duty as Americans to rectify this historic injustice and ensure that every individual, regardless of their circumstances, is protected from the horrors of slavery. May we stand together in our commitment to justice, to equality, and the preservation of the basic human rights of every soul that calls this land their home, and forge ahead on a path that upholds the values that define us as Americans. Thank you.